Hello everybody, welcome back to Dawn Guard. And today, uh, we're gonna get continue with the quest. I did uh, go around, kill some things, and uh, now I am level five vampire. I'm a level five vampire lord. Got power for the grave. Got the free center of things because uh, this night cloak was seemed like a priority with the difficulty that I'm on. In combat, you are surrounded by a cloud of bats that feed on enemies in me within melee range. I mean, that stuff is. You know, it's too good to uh, pass up, in my opinion. So it is what it is. So now I'm gonna go back to Bacalar Keep, or whatever you want to call it. <coughs> what the fuck? Are, yeah. So and now we're gonna get on with the mission, which was taught to the. Uh, to the leader. I already forgot his name because I haven't played this get place in a full day, so we should probably uh let's have a look. Prophet Harkin. His name is Harkin. Oh there's an alchemy table. Oh there's display case. Also I tried bringing Dakifus back and he's scared shitless of my vampire powers, so Oh wait, I don't even need to crouch. This is all here for the taking. Wisp wrappings. What's this? Damage, health, poison recipe. What's it say? Antlers and skiva tail. Oh, that's not. I probably won't do it. Probably doesn't do anything good. Did I see a? Hu was that a human heart or a Daedra heart? Ah, oh, Daedric heart. Not that we can do Daedric. Uh, oh shit. Not that we can do Daedric, uh... Smithing, but... Bah, it doesn't really matter. Hmm. Also, I did... I went to this area that has a lot of creep clusters, so let me get... Take this moment to, uh... Yeah, 22 creep clusters in the area that I, uh, found. I also put perks into, uh... Did I put points? No, I didn't put points in alchemy. Well, I'm going to, so... Oh, sh here has many advantages. Don't you agree? No, but I don't have any wheat, so I'm going to quit alchemy for now. Make those super potions that I don't even use. I just use make them to... Uh, bore me terribly. Oh, human heart. But they're a fact of life here. Did you sell anything? Here, oh, what he does. He does. Magic. I couldn't possibly... Yeah, blah blah blah. Couldn't give a shit. Yes. Um, Many in the court don't bother with potions, but I keep things stocked just in case. Good work. You got just what I needed. Don't even use these potions, but uh, they do come in handy. God, oh, there's some stuff I didn't. I don't even ha know the ingredients for yet, which is annoying. Follow here. your instincts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ingredients. Okay, let's just level. Let's just use it to level up my thing. And I also, I also can level up my speech as well with my uh, by selling this stuff. So you can't really complain. Look at that. Eleven, <laughs> eleven hundred for. Uh, anyway, it's damage, health, human heart. And then root. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's what we need. 40 damage. Okay, what else? Do we have something out that can ravage health? Yeah. Paralyze. I've already got a thing that paralyzes. Slow. Target moves at 50% speed, cost fine points. Jesus, that that's pretty good actually. I need to take a of that one. Uh, luckily I've recorded it so I don't need to write it down. <laughs> anyway, let's have a look. Regenerate health. Life here has many advantages. Fortify health. And where's the restore health? Damn it, it does damage. It damages my stamina, that's fucking annoying. 
Restore health, regenerate health. Okay, let's uh, do something else for the uh, fortify. Damn it, you'd think free health ingredients would uh, actually give a health potion, but nope, it just fails. Okay, let's move on, we'll do alchemy later. Or, when I say later, I mean off out outside of the recordings, because I know you guys don't want to see me do fucking random alchemy and shit, so we should be fine. Uh, what's up here? Oh, this is uh, this uh, chamber. Ah, there's a uh, Harkin. Sit down. Ah, you are here. Good. <clears throat> there's some. There are some things I want to ask you. You have earned my trust, so I will share what I can. When you greeted Serena, it sounded like you hadn't seen her in a long time. Serana and her mother. Serana. Hmm. Long ago, I commanded every vampire in the court to look for them. But after centuries of searching without success, I lost hope. In my heart, I know that it was my wife, Valerica, who took my beloved daughter away from <coughs> me. If I ever see her again, she will pay most dearly for that betrayal. What else do you want to know? I heard you mention Serana's mother. What happened her to her? Her name was Valerica. She has been gone for so long now, I can only assume she has left this world one way or another. I will say only that we did She's not... She's probably still alive. Terms. What else do you want to know? That's all, all I want to ask. Very well. Uh, you wanted to speak to me? Yes, I did. When I told you that I was grateful for my <coughs> daughter's safe return, I told the truth. But I did not tell you. I suspected as much. Good. Strong instincts and a cunning mind will serve you as well as blade, spell, or claw. As you know, vampires are powerful, but we have limits. Our great enemy is the sun. And until recently, it's an enemy we've had no way to fight. For centuries, I searched for an answer to this problem. I found an old prophecy written by a moth priest. Those scholars who read the Elder Scrolls. The prophecy tells of a time in which vampires will gain power over the sun and will no longer fear its tyranny. I believe the secret to unraveling that prophecy is written in Serana's Elder Scroll. I have ordered the court to assemble. I have a new task for us all to carry out, and that includes you. Come now. And hear my proclamation. I could check my Elder Scroll if you like. I mean, it could have some information. I mean, mine's for the dr mine's a dragon one, so <laughs> I don't know why I did that. What's up here? Yeah, those are that's a pelt. What's up here? Uh oh, what's that? Oh, it's just a, it's a fucking skull. Stay classy, I guess. Oh shit! No, get up there. Soldier. Um, no, 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 no. No, oh, fuck it. What the hell is that? Dragon pri priest dagger. I've never even seen one of them before. Fuck it. Doesn't do any damage. You'd think, uh, you'd think something like that would be a unique weapon, but not really. Oh, diamond. oh, diamonds. Um, yeah, of course, take the plate. That's what I wanted to pick up, the fucking plate. Okay, screw it. Is that a, oh, that's a gargoyle. Now it is time to see if those efforts have borne fruit. Oh, shit, he was talking. And search the land for rumours of a moth priest within our borders. Look to the cities. Speak to innkeepers, carriage drivers, anyone who would meet a traveler. Go now! 
and carry out this task. This is my command. Most interesting. Any idea how you're going to find a mob priest? Skyrim's a pretty big place. Where would a moth, moth priest actually go? Well, back before I... You know. The College of Winterhold was the first place I'd think to go for any kind of magic or historical thing. The wizards know about all kinds of things that people probably shouldn't know about. Actually, now that I think of it, I'm going to come along with you. I've been really wanting to get out and explore a bit. Sweet. I need to trade some things with you. It'll help. Well, let's see what you got. Grand staff of ch yeah, fuck that. Let's let's let's, see, let's give you something good. How do you feel about using a crossbow? What, 83 damage. I remember doing 83 damage. Screw it. The additional damage to vampire. Maybe should I, maybe, actually maybe I should hide these from them. Yeah. Or I could give it to her. Be ironic. Uh, give her a dagger. Oh shit! No, 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 no. Give her a dagger. And. I guess a uh, crossbow can hurt. With some uh, bolts, where are they? There they are. Apparel. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I can't even look at her apparel. Must have. Guess I'll give her the. Give her this uh, ring as well. Okay. Anyway, we got a dog over here as well. Let's see if we can... Ready for some bloodshed, beast. Let's sit our hunger together. Does that mean it's following me? Yes! We've got two companions. Life here has many advantages, don't you agree? Yeah, move out of the way so I can have the advantages of going outside and killing stuff. Steel smithing perk allows you to forge bone mold armor. Elven smithing allows you to blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that hurts. How do you react to sun? Well, better than most, I guess. Okay, where do we need to go? Let's first let's try and fast travel first. Uh, it's t -t 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 College of Winterhold. It's like place to go, I guess. What the fuck is that? It looks like a brute from Halo Three. Don't the Dawn kind has battle troll trolls? That's fucking funny. Have I got the right? Yeah, I have got the right one selected. Look at the Muff Priest. Visit College of Winterhold and ask about the Moth Priest. Well, let's hope they don't attack vampires on sight. I mean, look at this. I mean, look at that. Complete fucking badass. Hello! The local Nords may not like us very much. They don't seem to mind having access to enchanted weapons and armor. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right. You consider restoration a valid school of magic, worthy of study, don't you? Of course it's valid. Good. Good. Not that I require validation, of course. There are just some, and I shan't name names, who would disagree. It can make life difficult when one's colleagues fail to recognize the research one engages in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's your story. Welcome to the college. Yeah, yeah, I'm still a student. Actually, yeah, that's right. I had, to, I had to become a student in order to do the main quest. I forgot about that. Open the gear. You got you guys got anything interesting to say? Easy. Oh shit, 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 shit. shit. Wrong fucking We're getting ahead of ourselves here. Let's uh Leave that till later. I mean, if I pl if, you know, if I intend on doing the, uh, yeah, yeah, I don't give a shit. If I ever decide to uh, do the, uh, the college storyline, on, stop following me. Good lord. 
book, uh, the Ark, the bookworm. I don't want to see you treating any of these books poorly. Hundreds of years have gone into assembling this collection. It's I... going to stay pristine, understand? Would you be in interested in an Elder Scroll? Actually, maybe I should, you know, maybe I should, yeah, whatever. A moth priest? What an oblivion do you need a moth priest for? My business is my own. Just tell me <laughs> what I need to know. Fine, fine. No need to get your britches in a twist. The obvious answer is to go to the Imperial City. The moth priests make their home in the White Gold Tower. Sometimes they go out looking for Elder Scrolls. Lucky for you, there's a moth priest in Skyrim right now, doing just that. He stopped in to do some research in the library, then left for Dragon Bridge. If you hurry, you might catch him there. Okay, cool. Let's see if I could. Let's see what happens if I talk to him about the. Uh, you need a book. About the Elder Scroll. To me. Would you Otherwise be interested? Yeah, find yeah. Find yourself in a lot of pain. Would you be interested in in an Elder Scroll? Very funny. Did Enther put you up to this? Okay, if you don't want it, I'll find someone else who does. Wait, are you are you serious? You have an Elder Scroll. You? I would be honored. Beyond honored. Two thousand. This opens up entire new. Thank you. Please take this. It can't quite compare to an Elder Scroll, but still, you will be remembered for generations for this. Please make sure your hands are clean before touching anything. All right. What a fucking cheapskate! I'm not selling an Elder Scroll for two grand. I can find a higher bidder than that. Jesus Christ, he's fucking stalking me. Creep. Absolute fucking creep. Ah oh well. Let's see we got we got we found well, we deducted a uh, location for the priest, and so now we're gonna have to go find said priest. Yes, yes, my vampire blood blah blah blah. Uh, do we have to go all the way back to uh, what's it? First land, Dragon Bridge. I haven't been to Br Dragon Bridge yet. Hmm, okay, well, whatever. Solitude Sawmill. Most friends and hirelings that are following you can be ordered to interact with the world. They can unlock doors, pick up objects, go to specific locations, or attack enemies. They're not enemies of our. Uh, they're not enemies of us, are they? Where'd you come from? Going on. Oh, I guess we have enemy death hounds. Wait, why are they on our? We're vampires. We. Whatever. Vampires killing vampires. I guess. Let's see what this. Uh. Let's see what uh. Let's use, let's just use a let's just use the uh, dawn guard war axe. See what happens. Impressive. What are you doing? There we go. So where? Oh shit. Powers. There we go. So it's my blood drain power. What am I using? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Vampire Lord. No, that's not it. Drain. Is that a destruction spell? Oh yeah, it is a destruction spell. Didn't level it up at all though. Can't be a very good one. Fuck it. Uh, what are we doing? Oh, yeah, I still need to find a d decent enough axe to replace this fucking thing with. Just to, uh, just so an a I can have an axe that doesn't, uh have health, something that's different, maybe like a fire axe or something, I don't know, who, who, who knows. 
Oh well, let's just uh, let's make our way to uh, the objective, which is just over here. Maybe I should I should probably disable the uh, steam overlay in this game. Kind of breaks immersion when I see so and so popping up playing Team Fortress or what have you. Oh, me? Well, I know I am a vampire, but. <laughs> <laughs> well, after you just saw what happened to your friend, what do you want to do? Okay, I can't remember which one's paralyzed. None of them are glowing. Okay, that one's paralyzed. Even though it's not, it's weird because like even though I'm dual welding them, uh, mouse one uh, does the uh, the right hand and well, basically the left one does the right hand and the right hand does the left back so it's kind of confusing when I'm dual welding maybe I just change it when you're dual welding but I don't know if you don't if it was on if I was using my controller uh, it, it would make sense what's over here hey I'm a, a vampire well you never should have been in here whilst in the way I can't move you keep moving there we go. Where are you? Where's your corpse gone? Oh, there it is. Absolutely nothing. Okay. Okay, what's the story here? Imperial. Candles. Alchemy lab. What's this? I've already read this book, but... Fuck it. It's a skill book. Damn it, you fucking egg! Why do you have to roll out of the way and make me... <gasps> Uh oh, it's a dragon. The question is, what level dragon am I about to fucking fight? Let's bring out Sting. Send an Adonisaurus. Oh wait, that's wrong, Sting. Is that fucker gonna fly? Dragon is having a trouble having trouble deciding whether to attack me or not. Oh. It came out of the little s the sea. Where is that dragon gone? It's one annoying. I oh, hear yeah, that shit. The dragons come raw and then fuck off. Damn it! I want to kill a dragon. At least try to. Given the high difficulty level. Oh well, let's go let's uh, press on back to uh, to the objective, which is uh, appears to be. Yep, yeah, there we are, Dragon Bridge. Yeah, I explain why it's a dragon. It's a fucking dragon. It's Dragon's Bridge. Of course, it's supposed to be a dragon at Dragon's Bridge. It's like destiny or some shit. Also, I have to quick should quick save before entering at every single town because it's. After all, I am a vampire. I mean, look at this. Oh, Argonians look freaky anyway, so it's not like they can tell a diff tell the difference between a vampire Argonian and a normal Argonian. They all have sharp teeth and stuff. The fuck are we supposed to go then? have to just investigate the town. 